Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Um, today is Thursday and we're still on our week-long trip in the Lake District where we're just camping at Coniston and today we've driven into the Great Langdales just parked at the New Dungeon Gill Hotel um, the walk really starts from the old Dungeon Gill Hotel but gets quite booked up quite quickly and filled with cars so we couldn't get in so just turned around and went further down the road so adds a little road walk in to start with but that's okay at least we found a parking space so the plan today is just to take the Cumbrian Way up to Angle Tarn and Rosset Pike and then over onto Esk Pike and then eventually Bowfell for our highest point and then back around to the car park hopefully stop in the pub on the way back um, yeah so it's about nine and a half miles I think it'll be a bit more actually with the uh, walk along the road it might be 10 or 11 but it's quite easy along the road so but almost there um, yeah sun's come out today which is really nice so we can see the tops pretty easily so we should have a good view at the top as well got the team Team fell dogs. So we just took a right turn into the old Dungeon Gill and then cut through the farm, middle fell farm, and then we've gone left on the Cumbrian Way towards Mickledon and the Stake Pass. And then we're not go quite going to the Stake Pass, but we'll bear left further up to get to Angle Tarn as our first point. Um, quite a bit of drinking spots for the dogs so far which is good. I think there's quite a lot of water on the way around so that is good as well. Um, starting to get a bit warmer and heat up a little bit so yeah really nice day. So you can just see straight ahead onto oh, turn it around, but S Pike over there and Bowfell, which is where we're heading, and then off this way is uh, the Langdale Pike, so like Pike of Busco. Um, so yeah, we're just continuing to head up this path along the river. Oh, there's a nice swim spot, Bon. Oh yeah, good swimming. Come in. Nice. The water's so clear. She's so happy. Good girl. Ah, nice. Yeah, heading off into there, up and around. And back down. Having a little pit stop before we uh, make the ascent up to Esk Pike. Well, Angleton and Rosset Pike first. We've just gone over a footbridge and then um, kept left and just heading up the zigzaggy path all the way up there. Looking back over to the Langdale Pikes over there, 
and you can see where we've walked all the way through that valley along the path across the river and now heading up here to eventually find Angleton. Taking it steady today, neither of us are feeling great. <laughs> but it is one step at a time, no rush. Got the whole day, got a parking ticket for the whole day. Weather's great, just loving being out in it. down here. Come here. Jesse. Come here. 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 Close. Close. Path we're gonna head up afterwards up there and we've just made it to Angle Tarn so we'll just sit and have a bite to eat here before continuing up onto Esk Pike and then Bowfell. Heading up away from the town now. Um, behind me, you can see Rosset Pike, which you can go out and back onto. And we're just heading past the town, which is just there, up here, towards S Pike. Now you may go, but steady. Come on, steady.
looking onto Allen Carx just there. And we're just heading up that path in front of us and then left over onto Esk Pike and then Bofell in the distance, which we could see most of the way up when we were climbing up here, so that's quite nice. Bike with some amazing views. Yeah, you could just hike for days around here. Just keep, know, get lost in it. just keep going. Now you're up here. <laughs> Done the hard work. I reckon, I reckon this is the top of Esk Pike and then that would be both fell there I think yeah hey Never get bored of these. It's different as you go. Yeah. You can come a little bit higher up, it's different again, and coming back down.
almost at the top of Bofell now. Highest point of today, 902 meters. Still got the epic views. Where we came from, all the way down there over at S Pike Fire, Langdale Pikes, and we're going to make our way down this path here, keeping left and then back into the valley of the Great Langdales. Yeah. Good job, Bon. Are you tired now? Tired. Jets. Heading away from us annoyingly. Yeah, like like um RAF. They they practice around here. Come on. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they do all their training around here yeah. in the lakes. Just heading down to the tarns there. And then we're going to turn left to head back to Langell Valley. Whoa, -ho -ho. <gasps> dodgy. Cruising. Still got my trusty Labrador <laughs> following my every step down the mountain. Just turn the corner and you can see the path now heading all the way down there. I think that's the one we're getting. And then back onto the road to where we're parked by the new dungeon gill. And depending on how hungry or not we are, um 
we can stop at the old dungeon gill which is like immediately when we get down off the fell or go to the new dungeon gill or go to coniston footy many options <laughs> for food but definitely think, think we've earned some uh, chips for tonight oh that's so cool yeah. langdale pikes just there mega I think we're pretty much done, just arrived at Stool End Farm and then we'll just join the lane and then that should take us back to the old Dungeon Gill and then the new Dungeon Gill and car park. So I hope you enjoyed the walk, it was mega, highly recommend on a clear day when you can see literally every peak around. The views are just stunning and dogs have had a good time, Bonnie's been a little trooper with their paw. This is done pretty well as well. The longest walk yet, I think, yes. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.